And that, I could use that type of focus. I am terrified of speed because I'm terrified that I would enjoy it. You know, I like the kratom. Have you taken that? I have taken kratom. Have you taken it as a pre-workout? No. Well, yes. Well, I've taken it as a bunch of different things. But you know, Chris Bell, Chris yeah. and Mark Bell. Yeah, we we're talking about him yeah. the other day. So Chris Bell's the one who turned me on to it. That's who turned me on to it. And so he tells me if you take a small amount, it's sort of like a mild stimulant, like a cup of coffee. Yeah. But if you take a larger amount, it has a different effect. So I go, well, how many do you take? And he goes, well, before I work out, I take 10. I go, 10? 10. I didn't know that. You take 10? I go, so I take 10. So I took 10. And I was high as fuck. I was high as fuck. Took, wait, did you take 10 vials? 10 pills. 10 pills, okay. Yeah. Because the, the vials, the liquid form, oh, the liquid form. is oh more God. potent. Oh, yeah, that would be crazy. No, I, took, I take one of the, I've been doing it for a couple weeks, Yeah. and I feel fucking ready to go after that. I Does love it. Does it make you feel like you're ready to work out, like you feel better? I do. Yeah? yeah. Like mm -hmm. More energy? Uh-huh. It's a weird drug. It's a weird drug, though, because if I'm being totally honest... I also feel more confident on it. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I feel, I'm just like, I don't know. I feel more confident, but that's good, right? I think it's good for going into a workout. Yeah. Why is it, why, what's it bad for? It just makes me laugh because you say that and somebody goes, you mean like cocaine? And I'm like, <laughs> I guess so. Uh, but it's like, kind of like an opiate, right? I, I'm, I mean, I've heard different commentary about it, yeah. but I just know that I really liked it for uh, their stuff, Mind Bullet. I, I really liked it. Yeah. That it made me nervous when I tried ten. Ten, you like, might have, you might want to dial that back. I'm like, but you getting... also like I'm going to do a cold plunge for 25 minutes, so <laughs> <laughs> might be something in your brain doing that. Well, I just wanted to see what he was experiencing. Was he was telling me he was doing ten? I was only doing two on my own. Okay, because I think maybe it even said it on the label. I don't yeah. remember, but I was doing two, and I was like, hmm, gives me kind of like a good feeling. I like yeah. it. Like it was like a good cup of coffee. Chris is one of those guys who. Because I worked out with him in, in Sacramento. He can just go in there, on, you know, on a moment's notice and still pull five, 600 pounds. Really? So, yeah. Yeah. He's 50 something years old. Chris or Mark? Chris. Damn. Yeah. That's a lot. He's not yeah. a big guy. I know. Strong dude. Yeah. Just has that and switch. He has fake hips. Does he? Yeah. He had his hips. Mark is up. still a super fucking strong, yeah. too. Yeah. Yeah. But 10 is, you're getting high. Yeah. You're getting high, high. Like it's yeah. like it's a wild high. It's well, like a, this I feel kind like of high. Like ooh, that vial. If I had taken another one, I might be like that too, loopy. Yeah, but that's what it does. It's weird. It's like it has a different effect with low dose than it does with high dose. Mm -hmm. It's not like with low dose you get confident and a little pick me up, but high dose you get even more confident, more pick me up. Like, sure. No, I was high. High, high. I was high, high like we. Yeah. But I didn't have any motor control issues. Like uh, everything moved perfect. Sure, it wasn't like I was impaired. But like, you did. Did you finish that? Going, I don't want to do this again. Yeah, I never did it again. Never touched yeah. it again. Do you, you like, like any pre workout? Um, I don't generally. Generally, I'll I'll take a Kill Cliff. I like Kill Cliff. Okay, because it's like 150 milligrams, just B12 in it. Mm -hmm. 150 milligrams of caffeine, like Kill Cliff Ignite. I like those okay. pre workouts. But um. I, t I feel like what, what I, all I really need is to get sweaty. Once I get going, yeah. then I'm good. I have that thing. Wait, I mean, it's not probably that unique, but the feeling of breaking a real sweat just from lifting is so much more like rewarding I know what you're than saying. from cardio, yeah. right? Right, right, Because right. cardio, you go like, I'm definitely going to sweat as long as right. I. But you can do a, a lifting regimen where if you do it at a certain pace, you might not sweat. Right. But you still have like a pump going. Mm -hmm. But if you get after it with weights and you really start sweating, that's, I think it's one of the best feelings. Yeah.